When we talk about Jupiter, there's one feature that stands out above all its massive, mysterious great red spot. A storm so fierce, so immense that it's been raging for centuries. But how much do we actually know about it? And what's going on beneath those turbulent clouds? In this video, we'll dive deep into the secrets of the Great Red Spot and explore the incredible discoveries made by NASA's Juno spacecraft. The Great Red Spot isn't just big, it's a storm like no other in our solar system. First observed by Robert Hooke in 1664, this massive storm has captivated scientists and sky gazers for centuries. But what makes it so extraordinary? At its peak, this storm was large enough to engulf three Earth-sized planets. Today, it can still fit one Earth-sized planet inside it, though it's been shrinking over time. Data from Hubble suggests the storm has been shrinking and speeding up in recent years, with wind speeds increasing by 8% between 2008 and 2020. But despite all the observations, we've only scratched the surface of the Great Red Spot. To really understand what's happening inside this colossal storm, we need to get up close and personal. Enter NASA's Juno spacecraft. Juno was launched in 2011, and after a five-year journey, it arrived at Jupiter in 2016. Its mission? To study the planet's magnetosphere, its cloud tops, and yes, its great red spot. Juno's been making daring flybys of the planet, and it's provided us with never-before-seen insights into the storm, including data on how deep the Great Red Spot really goes. So, how did scientists uncover the depth of this storm? Well, Juno did something that had never been done before, measuring Jupiter's gravity and using microwave radiometers to peer deep beneath the clouds. First, researchers used Juno's gravity science instrument to measure fluctuations in Jupiter's gravitational field caused by the storm. And what did they find? The Great Red Spot extends more than 310 miles deep, about as tall as the International Space Station. But it doesn't stop there. Juno's microwave radiometer revealed that the storm's depths are even more complex, with precipitation and drafts extending even deeper into Jupiter's atmosphere. It's a storm that stretches far beyond what anyone had imagined. The Great Red Spot is an anticyclone. This means it rotates in the opposite direction of a cyclone. Scientists found that, like other anticyclones on Jupiter, it's colder at the top but warmer at the bottom. It's a dynamic, ever-changing system. Juno's data has also given us a deeper understanding of Jupiter's jet streams and how they interact with ammonia gas in the atmosphere. This is key to unlocking how the planet's weather systems form. Juno has already given us groundbreaking insights, but there's still so much more to learn. With a five-year mission extension in 2021, Juno will continue its exploration of Jupiter, including new views of its polar cyclones and moons. One of the most exciting parts of Juno's future mission is its orbit will take it over Jupiter's North Pole, giving scientists a fresh perspective on the planet's atmosphere. Juno is helping scientists unlock the secrets of Jupiter, and by doing so, revealing more about how our solar system formed. The Great Red Spot is a storm like no other, and with Juno's incredible mission, we're slowly unraveling its mysteries. It's a reminder that even in our own solar system, there's still so much to discover. Thanks for watching. If you're fascinated by the wonders of space, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more incredible discoveries from NASA's Juno mission and beyond.